I'm late. If I hurry, I just might be able to catch the tail end of Cookie and Snickerdoodle. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. And we'll let them breathe that in, and then I'll throw in the regen as well. Mm -hmm. And um, we'll just let them... The thing is, is it's not an instant fix. Like, they really do have to breathe it in for a while, but... After a little while, they, they should be better. At least oh, it seems wonderful. like that's what's happened with mine. And I haven't heard from JC that it didn't work for her yet, so. Yeah. So we just leave them to breathe it in and sleep? Yeah, leave them to breathe it in and sleep, and after a while, they, they should be good. Oh, okay. Anyway, so... I, I've i been looking for you because I wanted to help you out because I knew that you were very distressed about Snickerdoodle and Cookie. and I and. What, once I found out what was going on, I was like, I gotta help Drama. Oh, thank you so, so much, Stina. No problem. Well, maybe maybe we should let them convalesce. Yes, I think so. We'll sneak out. Okay. Shh. Will Stina's medicine work? Will Cookie and Sneakerdoodle be cured? Find out next time. Stay tuned for a new episode of Alpha World. But first, a word from our sponsor. Today on Alpha World, we're visiting Stina Rosa Zoo. A lot's been going on since I was here last, so let's dive right in. We're starting where everyone should start, at the Catnap Hotel. Hey Stina. Welcome, this... welcome. I love this place. <laughs> I need to get some chains in here. I just realized I haven't, mm. I haven't gotten the chains in. Yeah, I got to put chains oh. in my quarry too. They're so lovely. Just, just a second. Oh. I, I got I got uninvited guests. <sighs> Ow! <gasps> and viewers, let that be a lesson. Always sign into the catnap first. That's right. Or I'll have your head. Oh, you did, didn't you? Aye. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just we'll just put that there. Well, as you can see, we've done some wow. work on the zoo. Just a bit. Wow, look at just, this. Just a little bit. Yeah, there's still a lot more that I want to do, though. Like, I want there to be a complete loop all the way around. And obviously, you can see, you know, we don't yeah. actually connect back through. But so you're getting close. We're getting much, much closer. Much closer. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really pleased with how this oh. is coming along finally. I mean, it's been coming along fabulous. all season, but. Okay, we're, we're going to go down the shortcut. This is okay. this is behind the scenes. Sorry. Oh, oh. All right, viewers, behind don't the tell scenes. anyone. Don't tell anyone. No. This is the back side of the zoo. First floor lingerie, second floor menswear and ties. <laughs> Oh, the creep is behind glass. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I actually jumped. <laughs> I love it. See, that's the whole point. That's the whole point. I want yep. you to come in here and go, oh, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, mission accomplished. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's when the tour of the zoo. I hope that you enjoyed. Yeah. <laughs> But yes, the cave. I love the cave. You're very purpley, though. It's beautiful. So are you. You glow in the dark. The purple is fantastic. Oh, I love it. it did. The mine shaft under the floor. I, I love that so much. Oh, that was that was the whole point of this, because I wanted to have cave spiders, but I didn't want yeah. to have to locate them. And I was like, hey, let's just use a cave spider spawner. Mm. And then I don't have to play with them. No. It's brilliant. It's perfectly placed. By the way, you've got an unsupervised child in your spider pen. I do. I do. Um, this this unsupervised child spawned in there, and then I name tagged it, and now it's stuck. <laughs> and it just stands there and jumps. Just well, you know, Stina's childminding service, it's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> 
So, yeah, it, it's very excited to be a part of the zoo. Mm. I still have this pen over here, and if I'm if I'm lucky today, there'll be something in it. Nope. <sighs> what I really like in there is a zombie villager. Okay. So if ever I stumble or, across one... Well, I'm, I'm getting to the point where I'm thinking about actually just bringing a villager down here, name tagging it, and leaving it there until a zombie <laughs> decides to come and convert it, and yeah. Yep, that, that's kind of at the point I'm at right now. <laughs> the RSPCV the other option might have be... a few words to say to you. But we got our skeleton. You do. And we can find you a villager who's poorly and put them in there so that they're contained when it finally happens. I'm thinking a nitwit would be fine. Yeah. It can donate its <laughs> and body to zoological science. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> I mean, it would be the only purpose it could ever serve. Yeah. And then we got our witch. She's fabulous. But I do, I do love having the mine shaft down here because it's yeah. so much fun. Each time I come down, it's different, you know, because there's different mobs wandering about. Mm. There's different things to see, and I love that part. Yeah. There's also bats flying around here somewhere, but... Well, there should be. Yeah. And then Their you've always tag. got the spiders, too. Yes, and the spiders. Hmm. But yeah, the, the Enderman, he put down the, the, the block right here. Oh. And I'm like, are you kidding me? No. <laughs> that would have been so bad. Like a zombie or a skeleton I could handle, but if it had been a creeper. Oh, yeah, oh right, right over the spiders. No. No. It would have been that, so bad. That is literally scared. the stuff of nightmares. It is, isn't it? But I, I love this room. The atmosphere here is just so fun. It is beautiful. And it's the way to appreciate a cave without going, have I lit enough? <laughs> Exactly, exactly. It's really great until an Enderman puts down an unsupervised block. And we've got the strays. And, and we have the strays. These are my stray cats. I love that. It's a good stray way cats. to look at these mobs properly because normally we're running away from them or killing them from a distance and we don't get to appreciate what they actually look like. Exactly. Especially like these ones where you're, you're you know, they're strafing, they're... They're trying yeah. to kill you. Yeah. I, there's monsters nearby because this is the zoo. <laughs> mm. I, Don't try I, to sleep next to your pets. No, not a good idea. I mean, I knew they were in rags, but I didn't know they had amulets around their neck. Isn't it cool? Yeah. There are so many cool things to look at, especially with some of these more dangerous mobs. Mm. You know, once you get them behind glass, it's like, oh, I can really study you now. Yep. Mm. Over here we have Fen and oh, Ingrid. Bears. Yes, these are the polar bears that JJ and Wild brought me. You can actually come in and hang out with them. Just don't don't give them a high five in the face. No. <laughs> yeah, I I watched them being brought back at great personal risk. Uh yeah. Yeah, and then I, I used great personal risk to just get them in here. It was, it was yes. fun. <laughs> fun. You're certainly dedicated. <laughs> I was almost dead. Yeah. Dedicated. <laughs> <laughs> we have these le lecterns around. Eventually yeah. there will be books, which is the whole point of the lecterns, because we are. I have to write the books. Yeah, you do. <sighs> I do, I do. I want to give some information about, like, the polar bears. When did they first show up in Minecraft? You know, what's mm -hmm. some unique facts about them and things like that. Yep. But it's a work in progress. Life and habits of polar bears. And, of course, we have the wonderful chicken of Not knowledge, knowledge. And, and their family. Yeah. Just hanging out. <laughs> yep, all of them. So glad to have the chicken home. Yeah. He has I brought so much joy to so many people. He really has. And llamas. And llamas. Saving a whole world. I mean, I wish I could I could say the same about myself. Yeah. It's an amazing chicken. <laughs> How's his memoirs going, do you know? Um, last I checked, uh, he he told he erased my memory. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> I won't ask I'm you not, I'm apparently not allowed to know what the memoir, memoirs are about. Okay, this is all right. We, but, won't, we won't talk yeah. about that because there's only so many times no. you want to be retconned. 
I know, I know. There are husks in here somewhere. I can hear them. Oh, there's one down there. I hear. There's one. There's. There's supposed to be baby husks, but they despawn despite being um, oh. name tagged. But I think it's because the server glitched them into two different baby husks, oh. and then I brought them together, and then yeah, the server said, "Nope, you can't have any." <laughs> yeah. That's right. Hey, no, 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 no. Uh-oh, Nini. Uh, hang on. Got it. Thank you, Draymond. You're welcome. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, that's Mimi. To go with Eeny, Meeny, Miny, and Mo. Me. <laughs> Hello. And Stu. <laughs> yep. And this other one is Suspicious. Hello. Suspicious <laughs> Stu. <laughs> and of course, no zoo would be complete without a woodland mansion. Yeah. These guys I, terrify me. I saw this before, but I believe your guys have come out of the corners. They have. They. Ha I mean, I know he's standing in the corner right now, but they wander about now. Mm. But still, don't tap on the glass, because I don't no. trust that they are not going to go berserk. No. We don't need vexes, ve vexing the whole zoo. <gasps> They've got tartan pants. I thought they just had plain pants. I know! Again, this is a thing where you don't realize it because you can't study them. No. Wow. I'm learning so many new things today. So I this think is what it goes a zoo is with for. The fact, I know, exactly. It kind of goes along with the fact that the uh, the pillagers are kind of in tartan as well. Yeah. And of course, then there's the scariest of all scariness. Oh, I my really, goodness. Yeah. This one terrifies me of course yeah. i'm not a fan of vexes at all so no and if it so much as lays an eye on you it's vex city i know i know and then it you know and then it comes over right to the glass and it'll stare at you and it's like no that sound reminds me of a sheep, which is our next exhibit. Oh, cool. <laughs> Segways are us. I know, I know. By the way, if you look up, you can see a sheep's brain. <laughs> Foot of grass. It is, see? I love this setup. Oh, this, this makes me, this whole room makes me so happy. Uh, because um, not only do we have all the different color sheep, but all the ones in these pens are named after wonderful people who donated last year to my Extra Life stream. Oh, lovely. So, and their names are yeah, here on the, the wall. And, and the bigger donors, are their names are on the wall. Why is there... Wait. What's up? There's a pig. There are two pigs. Someone's turning your sheep into pigs. You know who it is, is this... don't you? It's the hedge cows. It is. But... Okay, the Steve and Alex thing, that was bad enough, but turning yeah. sheep into pigs? Yeah. We still don't know where the Steve Somebody and Alex better... virus came from. What are they turning pigs into? Uh, that's... If they're turning sheep into pigs, what are they turning pigs into? We should learn Pigglesworth. We should. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I haven't seen oh, him on the server recently. I know what they're turning him into. Do you remember that he kept his head kept turning into Seamus's head? <gasps> oh my goodness, you're right. This does, is wait. Does that mean that Seamus is? No, no, no. We're not going to go there. No, 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 no. This is the home. I'd say of the Seamus smelly... is a victim in this as well. Okay. This is the home of the smelly horseman. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but this is another guy where you never actually get to look at them. No, because you're running away terrified. <laughs> I know, trying to kill, get them off yeah. their horses. But I didn't realize like they sink down into the vertebrae yeah. of the horse. It's like their, their vertebrae connect. Yeah, which is freaky. 
It is freaky. But it's really cool. It is. This is my foxes. I love your foxes. Fabulous it was such an adventure. Such an adventure getting the white foxes. How far out did you have to go to collect them? Uh, well, I found them before we, you know, the snow village? Mm -hmm. I discovered the snow village while I was looking for them. So I went out to the desert and then just traveled north from there and eventually came across that area. Yeah. It. So I had to bring them back through the desert. Oh, it was it was fun, fun. Don't don't bring don't bring foxes near bunnies. We'll come up this way because this is our water area. Yeah. <laughs> I still have only one guardian in here. I need to get a few more. You do. Yeah, lots of salmon, I and they're all trying to swim upstream. <laughs> Oh, I know. I know. But it would be really cool to have, like, six of these guys swimming mm. around, I think. Mm. Because this one, he's very lonely. Poor little thing. I know. I know. This is one of my new favorite exhibits. Yeah, I watched you build this. I love the whole idea of this. Welcome. I just this is, love this place. This is all our fun fishing put to good use. Well, at least at least showing off some of it. Yeah. <laughs> there's there's yeah. more hanging around Several inside. Several thousand fish. <laughs> Only yeah. You guys really took on the challenge, and I so appreciate it. It was fun. And as I said, I learned to I identify them all. I just it's been a while, and now I can't. <laughs> I still have to figure out how to get squid in here and how to get a dolphin. And that scares me. The squid's gonna I be easy, know. the dolphin's gonna be really hard. Now up here is my son's favorite exhibit. The next bug to the jar. catnap. Welcome to the bug jar. And it's it's okay to walk in, isn't it? Yeah, because they've got glass yes. between you and the <laughs> They've got glass between you, you've got glass above these guys. But yeah. I really wish that they would actually kind of float around instead of just being trying to get out, but no. it is what it is. Here's your beautiful barn. Oh, this is my, one of my newest exhibits, and I love the way that this one turned out. Managed to get a couple more residents in here too. Oh, cool. So we've got we've got the start of. I want to get every kind of horse. Mm -hmm. Like there's seven different colors of horses and each horse has, each color has five varieties. Mm -hmm. So I'm in the process of finding them all. <laughs> you should, um, it's coming. you should post a list in spawn of what you're missing. Oh, that's actually a good idea. This was you... such a fun exhibit to put yeah, together. I, I love this place. Oh, I had such a blast hanging out with Pigglesworth and doing this exhibit. It was so much oh fun. Oh my goodness, they've separated. Yes, they have. Yeah. About this, <laughs> these guys are fighting over who's going to go through the door. <laughs> but um, about the time that the, the guys in the Woodland Mansion started moving, those guys moved too. So maybe, I don't know. They all just adjusted. Yeah, they did. They're they're better adjusted now. And and of course these guys the big guys are terrifying. They are. They I get mean, so angry. Even just like this, it's like no. <laughs> <laughs> but they're so cool because it's like you don't get to just look at these guys ever. No. See the chains on them and I've been thinking about putting uh, little sleeping stations along the way in the zoo just so mm. that people can rest. Because yeah. I'm thinking, you know, it's going to take a while to do these. Yeah. Uh, well, you think when you go to a zoo, there are, are rest stops and 
picnic areas. And... Exactly. Exactly. And I could actually do it like by these uh, boards with the, oh, yeah, the maps yeah. and have it like a little bench rest area and you got the map where you can see where you are. Yeah, no, that'd be a great idea. Here's the witch. And then we have, we have Granny. She's very bad tempered. Mm. <laughs> but if you tell her jokes, she does laugh most of the time. I, I still need to get a black cat in here. Mm. I haven't done that yet because she needs a black cat. I'm surprised one hasn't spawned actually. This isn't a real, uh, this is, I built this. What? This isn't a real witch hut. Wow, I thought it was. I was going, wow, Steve is so lucky she's got this witch hut just perfectly placed. No, my witch hut is actually right over there. I have a I have a regular one, uh -huh. uh, but it's outside of the zoo. And then here's the place of my most recent death. Yeah. You guys better still be in there. And the big one has broken apart. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? After all that work, it broke apart? Oh, no. <laughs> so do you think they've thrown themselves against the wall or something? Or I don't know. I, I really don't know. I don't know if they're getting, like, suffocated in the wall. I don't know if they're... They, they shouldn't be endangering each other, but somehow they're splitting. No. Nope. Pretty soon I'm going to be having a slime daycare, at which point we can make it a petting zoo. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you nasty little boogers. Your child mining service is really interesting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, this is my behind. favorite, favorite, favorite thing. I love the llama go round. <laughs> if I let you have it. If I let you have a go, will we ever finish the tour? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm going to resist getting on because I won't want to get off. <laughs> Isn't it lovely, though? It I is. love I love this thing. And, uh, you know, I, I say it a lot, but huge shout out to Amy because <gasps> she came up with this design. And then she was so, so sweet to let me use it. Like, she is a genius. <laughs> this is just she, glorious. She is. Now, rumor has it that she's got a bigger one, but she <gasps> won't let me know what that one's at. Like, <gasps> rumor has it she's got an eight llama configuration. <gasps> no. But she's not sharing. <gasps> That's just what the rumors say, though. And, you know, you can't have llamas without having a fashion show. No, not at all. <laughs> They are gorgeous. It's kind of like collecting cats, only this one's playing dress up. Yes. <laughs> and you've got to get the carpet llama color combination right. Exactly. Exactly. And then we have the pandas. The pandas. I love my pandas. They were so much work. I was about to oh ask how hard was it to get all of them. Oh, it was awful. Let's just say um, I had to do a lot of breeding and selective um, culling of the herd. Mm. A lot of it. Over 500 times. <gasps> a lot of it. Wow. This guy out here scares oh. me. Yeah. But again, you get to look at him. I mean, the I effect around him is incredible. I know. And and knowing that if that block of glass was gone, yeah. This would be a crater. Yep. Yep. If that goes, he takes everything yep. with him. Everything. Including these guys, probably. Ah! Oh, it's you! Oh, <laughs> they shouldn't do that. <laughs> Sorry, it's not funny, but it is. It's because you've got. 
I got the creeper nearby. Yep. <laughs> but because you've got the creeper nearby, it makes them hissing even more I know. frightening. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and then we got we got our DJ sheep. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I love this place. It is really funky. And then uh, we come across the bridge to the area that um, isn't done. <laughs> okay. So this is where the loop has so the, to join up. Yeah, well, see, this is going to go into a great big um, village, actually. Oh, okay. This is going to become, this area in here is going to become a bustling village. Mm -hmm. I just have to build it so this is going to be where um the local residents live oh. of the villager variety a flower village and then it's yeah it's going to be a flower village and then it will come off somewhere on this side to mm -hmm. connect with the rest of the loop but yeah that's that's the zoo for now it's, it's brilliant I, I love it <laughs> i hope that you enjoyed your tour oh, very much you've done a magnificent job stina i can't wait to see it 100% finished, but it's fabulous. Oh, well, make sure that you come back as we get more exhibits going because... Yes, please. I have my season I pass. I think we're... Yay! 